uh, welcome to UX Techno. Today, now we are going to learn about uh, what you mean by access control list, which is also called as a Linux ACL. In our previous video, we have uh, seen the um, issues uh, with related error related to uh, permission denial. Uh, the, the method which we have used uh, earlier, which are not secure since uh, when you give the command or uh, when you give the permissions to any users uh, it is accessible for all the users within system uh, it is not applicable to one particular single user so in order to give the permission to particular user you need to use the access control list uh, so we'll be proceeding with how we can set it up uh, the access control list uh, for example, let's say you have got the uh, slash etc directory, which is only modifiable uh, by the root user and you need to give uh, uh, permission to normal user uh, like we have a normal user called Manmohan in our system and you need to give the permission inside the etc directory so that um, the Manmohan user can uh, create uh, directories as well as file inside the etc directory so here we go suppose uh, we have got uh, one more user we'll go to etc and we will try to create one directory this is the uh, this is the issue we need to give the permission uh, so that the manmohan user can create uh, uh, create the file inside the my drm which is inside the slash etc so first of all we need to uh, we need to create one directory inside the etc directory okay, etc Oh, sorry, my dir. Now, basically, in access control list, there are two sets of commands that you need to use. The first one is get facl, and the uh, another one is set facl. So, for setting up the permission using a access control list, you need to use set facl command, and and to get the uh, desired uh, output, I mean, what all permissions you have given. Uh, to check that you we need to use the get facl command so first of all we will be giving the uh, permission to the manmohan user so uh, the command will be set facl hyphen m sorry hyphen r hyphen m the r stands for uh, recursive hyphen m stands for modification and we will be using user then the name of the user which is manmohan and we need to give read write and execute permission to the slash etc my dir folder so that's it now after you have given the permission we need to check whether or we have set the permission uh, properly or not to check that we will be using get facl command slash etc my dir see uh, we can easily see that for the user manmohan we have given the read write execute permission so that uh, the manmohan user can create the files or directory inside the my dir directory now let's see we go to my dir and um, we will try to create one directory test yes so one more user having now uh, write permission inside the etc directory and he, he can create a file also let's test it test it out on txt So that's all. 
uh, let's suppose you have got the multiple uh, users in that case what we need to use uh, uh, give the command called set facl fnr fnm user manmohan or wx and comma uh, user the second user maybe we will uh, use Rahul as a second user and the permissions and after that my yeah this command you will be using if you want to uh, use uh, you if you want to give the multiple users uh, the same permission you can use it in a single command and once you have given the permission uh, suppose you want to remove the permission uh, like we don't now we don't want one more user to be uh, you know uh, need not to be create any folder inside the etc my dir command so to remove it we need to use set facl hyphen x flag user one more and etc my dir so all the given permissions are now gone if you check it if you see here slash etc my dir sorry see earlier there was a user called manmohan which is having a read write execute permission now we have removed it using hyphen x flag inside the set fc so this is how uh, we use uh, access control list uh, for uh, uh, giving an access to the normal user so that he can create the files or a directory inside uh, the uh, inside the directory where he he do not have the permission thanks a lot please do like my and share video thanks thanks a lot